correct sight read knowledge deficit. Here are the steps. The first step is write a sentence on chalkboard with the new word used in context. Underline the word. Good morning, everyone. Good morning, Rhea. Okay, Rhea, do you have an idea about the word sight word? Mom, I think sight word is a word that an individual can read without sounding it out. Okay, very good. How about you, Jesse? Do you have an idea about the word deficit? Um, I think, ma'am, deficit is... Oh, deficiency is loss, ma'am. Okay, very good. Next step is... Let students read the sentence and attempt to say the new word using context clues, along with other word attack skills. If you are introducing a new story, it is especially important that you do not tell them each new word in advance, as this deprives them of the opportunity to apply word skills, word attack skills themselves. Step is, let students read the sentence and attempt to say the new word using context clues, along with other word attack skills. If you are introducing a new story, it is especially important that you do not tell them each new word in advance, as this deprives them of the opportunity to apply word skills, word attack skills themselves. The sentence is, Sam is sitting in a cafe in New York Park, sipping a cappuccino in the bright spring sunshine. The third step is, discuss the meaning of the word or how it is used in talking and writing. Try to tie do something in their experience. If possible, illustrate the word with a picture or a concrete object. Rhea, can you please read the sentence? Coffee made with milk that has been frothed up with pressurized steam. Very good. This is the pig. This is the photo of a cappuccino with a coffee beans beside it. Fourth step, write the word as students watch. Ask them to look for certain configuration clues such as double letters, extenders, and descenders. Also, ask them to look any well-known phonograms or word families. For example, ill and ache. But do not call attention to little words in longer words. Kita nyo na po ba? Yes. Okay, very good. I would just write here the word cappuccino. C A P P U C C I N O. Have you seen those words that have double letters? Those letters that have double letters? And what are those letters? Yes, ma'am. What, are, what letter, are those letters, Rhea? Letter P and letter C. Very good. Letter P and letter C. Good job. And let's go back to our PowerPoint. The fifth step is... Ask students to write the word themselves and to be sure have them say the word. And the last step is, have students make up and write sentences in which the word is used in the context. Have them read the sentences to each other and discuss them. Please say the word cappuccino. Cappuccino. Okay. And now, we will have an activity. You will... Think of a sentence that has a cappuccino. Is it clear? Yes, ma'am. Yes, ma'am. Okay. And I will go back to you later if you are done. Just think of a just think of a sentence that has a cappuccino. And tell me if you're done, okay? Yes, ma'am. Okay, I will wait for you. Are you done? Yes, ma'am. Okay, Jesse. Yes, 
What's your sentence? I love to drink cappuccino. Wow, very good. How about you, Rhea? Mom, to make the perfect cappuccino, you will need an express an espresso machine. Very good. Good job. And guys, we're almost done. And I just I teach you how to correct sight read knowledge deficit. Did you understand the lesson? Are the steps or the strategies? Yes, ma'am. Yes, ma'am. Okay, good, good job. Right then.